Mortensen is a family-owned uh, private construction company founded in 1954, focused on a set of core values and really keeping our customer as the primary focus in everything we do. We were introduced to SketchUp early on in our goals to try to find ways to build our projects and get our project teams thinking about the way we're going to build the projects virtually. Some of the things that we're doing with SketchUp that we have never been able to do before is that some of the uh, virtual mock-ups, uh, specifically with the enclosure and building types and sequencing. And so we're using a mock-up of enclosure systems that might take 10 different subcontractors and how all of their work integrates and we're able to put together a plan that shows the sequencing of that work in a very short manner of time and actually adjust that as we discuss how those systems come together. And that's something that I've never seen another tool be able to do quite as efficiently. It's great because we're able to, to really uh, provide a cost aversion to the project. Um, we've seen savings up to $180,000 in terms of building four virtual mock-ups in lieu of one physical mock-up. Any time that we could use the model to solve problems that might have occurred on the project site it saves us money. Recent examples is on some virtual mock-ups where, the, where there was not a lot of information available for some enclosure systems. And so the model allowed us to build it virtually. Uh, and then we, we found lots of small details that over the entire face of a large building would have been significant field modifications and added resources for the project team. And solving those virtually saved tens of thousands of dollars. What's been great about SketchUp is that we will have a challenge that we need to face and in a very short period of time, in a matter of whether that's hours or um, a, a day or two, we can have uh, responses to uh, issues that are, we're facing out in the field in a way that we can communicate the solutions both to the subcontracting partners and to our owners in a very quick manner. When we encounter a problem in construction, we send out a request for information to the design team. It takes a couple days to respond because we're typically just writing it out or drawing a sketch. What we do now is use SketchUp to develop 3D models of the question. And we send that out to the design team and we get faster turnarounds. Another key way we use SketchUp is in our site logistics planning. Every project we build has a lot of constraints on the project site. We need to be able to communicate our plan, and those plans are dynamic. It's always changing. And SketchUp's a great tool that allows us to, to take that plan and change it quickly. Things change all the time, and having a uh, site logistics plan built in SketchUp allows us to be very nimble. Before the use of layout, building presentations were really cumbersome. With the use of SketchUp and layout, we're able to, on the fly, quickly change things, annotate them, and those annotations are linked you know, closely to the, the image of the model. Layout seamlessly allows us to integrate the 3D model in a 2D representation, and it allows us to make changes really fast, uh, and that's the real power there. I mean, what we find on any project where we have a model is we build it for a, a single a purpose, but as soon as it exists, we find new ways to use it because it's there and then our superintendent would say, oh, can you change that because I have a better idea of way I'm going to do something over here. So what we say is not only does it drive um, collaboration, but it drives innovation because the model, having something in 3D and something people can put their hands around, it starts to make them think about new ways to do things and it starts to, starts to give them new ideas on how to use the tool and how to do their job.